In this video, I want to demonstrate how to assign students to a class and keep them in their same class or keep the same class together. I'm on the promotion management page. I got there by going to organization and manage promotion. You can also get there by going to administration and under manage select promotion. It's the same page. The first thing you want to do is to select the promotion group or promotion type. In this case, I want 10th to 11th grade. I've already moved the upper grades. And I'm going to select a schedule, in this case, 11 o'clock. And the target class will be just those classes that are in that promotion group at that time. So I'm going to select this first one, the boys class. And I don't need to bother with the unassigned only because I know there aren't any in this group that have already been assigned and I don't need to exclude the teachers. I'm going to move the teachers and we're going to keep the entire class together. So once I have these filters in there, go to current class and click on that header and it will sort by the current class. You notice over here on the right you've got 17 people in this entire group. Not all of them are in the boys class. You can see there are only 14 that are boys. So I'm going to select those 14 and move them into the other class. There's only one class of 10th graders and one class of 11th graders at that particular hour. If I select the first box and I scroll down, I'm looking at the current class name. I go to the last one in the list right before it changes to the girls class. I'm going to hold down the shift key and then select this box. Notice it selects everybody in between the first one in the list and the last one that I selected. So this is the group that I want to move. This is that, that boys class number one with Brian Knight as the teacher. And now I want to just click the blue assign to class button. You're going to wait for the page to refresh. And it takes a few seconds, so don't, don't rush it. There it is. You saw the page move just a little bit. And now you see there's a pending class. If I sort by the pending class, you'll see that 10th grade boys moved to 11th grade boys. And it kept the same teacher. So the only ones left are the girls. So I can go back up here. I need the same promotion type, same schedule, but I need to change my target class. And in this case, it's the girls. And I just scroll down. I've already got them sorted. So I just scroll down here, select the first one, hold shift, select the last one. There are only three girls to move. Go back up here, verify that I had the right promotion type, schedule, and target, and then assign to the class. And that's how easy it is. It's just very simple when you're doing the current class and it keeps those classes together. That means that they are going to be on the pending tab of this boys class. So if I click that link, that will take me to the 11th grade boys class. And these are the current members. But if I go to the pending members, these are the students that I just moved, those 14 that I just moved to that class. So that's how you can keep them in the same class when you're managing promotion.